Princess Britney Spears has been keeping us entertained with her dancing videos on Instagram and TikTok throughout the global lockdown, but her chaotic energy has worried some of her fans. The Free Britney movement has been trending on social media, and the conservatorship Britney has been under for the last 12 years is also being talked about. Over the years, Britney has also reinvented herself and her looks more than once, and today we're going to be looking at this singer's overall transformation. Britney Spears is a singer, songwriter, dancer, and actress who's credited with the revival of teen pop during the late 90s and early 2000s. If you're a 90s kid like me, you probably love her as much as I do. Britney was such an icon and still is. Despite her global success and long list of accomplishments, including a Vegas show, business ventures, multiple hit albums, and numerous awards, her life hasn't been all roses. Unfortunately, many of Britney's personal struggles have been publicized and she's often been a target of the tabloids. Her conservatorship is also talked about a lot, which means her father, Jamie Spears, has control over her life decisions. Usually a conservator isn't necessary for someone as functional as Britney, which is why it seems wrong. I have really good days and then I have bad days. Sometimes it's like too much. Nobody could deal with the last couple of years, things that have happened, not with the, even the business. Things that just happened to me personally have been the problem. Fans have even protested in the past for the Free Britney movement and started petitions online to get her free of the conservatorship. Fans out in force to support their favorite uh, singer. It's the battle over Britney. Pop star Britney Spears' parents faced off in court as they fight over conservatorship of their daughter. Most recently, there's been some concern after Brit began posting many videos on social media, either dancing, walking back and forth, or talking extremely fast. If you need help, wear yellow in your next video, a fan commented on Spears' Instagram post. Fans noticed that in her next video, Spears was wearing a yellow top and white shorts. As of now, Britney is sure she's okay, but I guess we'll have to wait and see if Free Britney ever happens. Until then, we're gonna take a look at the pop princess's beauty transformation over the years and how she's changed. What's going on guys and girls? My name's Kara and this series we've titled Before and After. We're gonna be looking at Britney Spears, one of my favorite artists out there, and how she's changed her looks over time, including any plastic surgery, her fitness, and more. I've done other celebrity transformation videos and the likes of Jessica Simpson and Mia Khalifa, and we'll link some at the end. Be sure to like, hit subscribe, and ring that bell for notifications. As always, if there's anyone else you want a before and after on, let me know in the comments down below. Follow me over on Instagram to chat and let's get into this video. Britney has always looked like the all-American dream. Take any photos from the 90s and the girl was flawless, rocking a perfect smile, style to absolute perfection, and usually showing off her famous rock hard abs. Since her first music video, she was known for showing off her midriff, whether in a sexy schoolgirl costume or crop top and low rise pants. But who could blame her? The girl worked hard on her fitness and it showed. As Britney's fame kept rising, she always rocked some shade of blonde hair and the best outfits. Her style soon emerged into something even sexier, featuring smaller crop tops, often paired with short shorts or tiny skirts. Who could forget the Slave For You era? It was then she put her super fit figure on display at the 2001 VMAs while performing with a snake. From pop sensation to paparazzi target to mother of two, Brit continued to shapeshift over the years, and with every new album and tour, she's proven she could reinvent herself. Never one to stay out of the spotlight for long, Britney has grown into her own brand brand, whatever current style she's embracing. Now, in her late 30s, Britney still works on her fitness even if she is spending most of her days at home. That flat stomach doesn't look like it's going anywhere and neither are her favorite low-rise shorts. Britney also recently got bangs. She still has long blonde hair which seems to suit her the best, but took to Instagram to show off her new hairstyle. While most of us probably couldn't dream of pulling bangs off, it's clear they look great on Brit. What do you guys think? I'm definitely a fan of her new hair. Considering almost every celebrity has either had plastic surgery or has rumors about getting work done, of course it's no different for Britney. Since cosmetic work definitely has an effect on how a person transforms over the years, let's see what Britney's gone under the knife for. My main thing is to enjoy life mm -hmm. and take today, take one day at a time. I have really good people around me that support me and what I do in my daily life, and so I'm really blessed. It does seem Britney's face looks a little bit different, but it's hard to pinpoint exactly what's changed. Of course, she's older, so natural changes are bound to occur. But Britney doesn't keep it a secret that she has her own surgeon. She admitted in a 2014 interview, a doctor I see, Beverly Hills plastic surgeon Dr. Ray Kanodia, does fun stuff to me sometimes. I've had lip injections before. So we know Brit is a fan of lip injections. We can see a noticeable difference in some photos where they look more plump, but in my opinion, it's nothing too drastic. But what does the other fun stuff mean? We can only speculate, but there are a few possibilities. 
A lot of online sources report that Britney likely had a nose job. Comparing photos from then and now, I do see what they're talking about, but I'm not sold on this theory just yet. Her nose does appear slimmer and have a more feminine shape, and the tip is apparently less bulbous. However, she's always had a nice nose, and a lot of it could be the work of contouring in Photoshop. If Britney did get a nose job, it was quite subtle and done to suit her face. What do you guys think? Although there are rumors that Britney has had a facelift, I think that's a little drastic to assume someone who's not even 40 years old yet had one. I do believe she gets some anti-aging procedures done, but my guess is Botox and or fillers. And I'm not the only one who thinks this. A professional plastic surgeon has explained her thoughts on Britney's look, stating, In my professional opinion, I believe she has had filler injected into her cheeks and Botox into her brow since her cheeks seem fuller and her brows are raised. Comparing pics of before and after, I do think Britney likely uses fillers to combat wrinkles and possibly to lift her eye area as well as cheekbones. However, I don't think any invasive plastic surgery would have been done on those areas yet since Britney doesn't look all that different. Finally, another rumor that has floated around over the years is that Britney got breast implants. In 2017, she took to Instagram to show off part of her workout routine, and fans quickly began to comment on her breast size, questioning a possible enhancement. Personally, I give Brit the win here. I think all that is some push-up bra action, and although it looks great, I don't think it indicates fake boobs. However, that doesn't mean she hasn't gotten them in the past. In an interview with Rolling Stone, Britney's mom Lynn said she gave her daughter permission to get breast implants as a teenager. She said that soon after, Brit regretted them since her body was still changing, and when her natural breasts grew larger, she had the implants taken out. But oops, she might have did it again. Over the years, there has been photos showing a drastic size change in Britney's chest, but it's not always that obvious. Honestly, I'm torn on this one. Do you think Britney has implants now, or is it all natural? Finally, since Britney is a mom of two, sometimes people wonder how on earth she kept that flat stomach and those famous abs. Of course, I'm not surprised she's been accused of having liposuction too. Although some said back in 2007 the pop princess had a procedure done called lipo dissolve, there's no confirmation of this being anything more than a rumor. Britney is known for working out a lot and keeping on top of her fitness. If you need proof, just head over to Instagram. In the case of Britney's flat and fit tummy, I believe it's just the result of good old fashioned exercise. Which brings us to our next section. No matter what Britney has or hasn't had done, she's dedicated to taking care of herself, which includes working out. She's told Women's Health in the past about her workouts. I start with 20 minutes of intense cardio, usually running, move on to light free weights, body weight exercises such as push ups, squats, and sit ups, then finish it off with a stretch. More recently, Britney shares a lot of her at-home workouts, and they've definitely been inspiring to watch, especially during quarantine and the current era of at-home fitness. Although Britney had an incident where she burned down part of her gym, she explained on Instagram. Hi guys, I'm in my gym right now. I haven't been in here for like six months because I burnt my gym down, unfortunately. Um, I had two candles and yeah, one thing led to another and I burned it down. So I'm in here and I only have two pieces of equipment left. And I'm going to show you guys what I do during this time. And the queen was still able to lead us through a series of arm lifts, squats, side lunges, and planks. So we know the woman is innovative and likes variety in her workout routines too. Just some of the exercises Brittany does to keep her fit physique include step up knee raises, handstand walks, bicep curls, and she's also a huge fan of doing squats and sit ups to keep her legs and abs toned. In fact, Britney loves sit-ups so much that she's known for doing 500 a day or up to 1,000 on a really good day. So maybe her secret to rock hard abs really is that simple. Britney doesn't stop with those workouts either and it's clear the star likes a variety of activities to stay in shape. Usually in the mornings I swim 20 laps every morning, but this morning I'm gonna go for 60. Do you think I can do it? She tries to get into 90 minute yoga sessions a week, swims in her pool often, and loves to hike. Not to mention all that dancing she posts to her social media. All right guys and girls, that wraps up this video here in Before and After. Looking at the princess of pop Miss Britney Spears over the years, we can see how much she's transformed. I think it's amazing that despite her struggle, she's always been able to bounce back and reinvent herself. Although I'm sure me and Britney fans alike will remain concerned about her well-being in current states, she posted on Instagram saying that she's okay, writing. I get how some people might not like my posts or even understand them, but this is me being happy. This is me being authentic and it's as real as it gets. I want to inspire people to do the same and just to be themselves without pleasing others. That's the key to happiness. But at the same time, I don't know what that statement really proves. I guess we'll just keep having to try and free Britney. After looking at Brit over the years and her transformation from then until now, what did you guys think? What was your favorite Britney era? And what work do you think she has or hasn't had done? 
I love Britney in all eras, it's way too hard to choose, but I remember when her self-titled album came out with Slave For You, I replayed that CD over and over again until it was scratched. Even these days, I'm impressed by what great shape she's in and how committed she is to staying active. And to keeping that flat stomach. Anyways, let me know what you guys thought down in the comments, as well as who else I should do before and after on. If you want to talk more about Britney's transformation, you can hit me up on Instagram. Be sure to subscribe, and I'll see you all in the next video. Bye!